All right, my boys. Yesterday, I uploaded a video showing you guys I take nice, peaceful walks from time to time. Now, don't get me wrong. Your boys got to get out there and touch grass every now and again. But while I was taking a walk, I did come to an interesting little thought or revelation. Why does Konami come out with these really, really weak spell cards? These really weak fusion spell cards specifically. Now, I don't mean to just kind of make this point about this but it all started with this. So someone left a comment on my video and basically asked me to take a look at the Gladiator Beast United card. Okay, in case you don't know what that is, it is a fusion spell card for the Gladiator Beast archetype. That's a quick play spell. And you might say, that's pretty disgusting. That's pretty busted. Fusion quick play spell for an archetype? That's pretty gross. You know, when you think about a fusion spell, what do you think about? You think about branded fusion, okay? Like like these days, you know, let's just take dual links out of it. Let's just take all the other Yu-Gi-Oh's out of it. You think branded fusion. Branded fusion is such a good spell card with so much utility. That card has to be put down to one in Master Duel. And I think it's put down to one in the TCG and OCG as well. That's how powerful branded fusion is. But cards like Gladiator Beast United does not have uh, such a claim. So let's just talk about this card. There's been new retrains of really old cards. And even right now, I think we're getting, um, what's the name of that card? Despair from the Dark is even getting a retrain right now. If Despair from the Dark can get retrained right now and be halfway decent, can Gladiator Beast at least get a normal fusion spell that they can use with Verte Anaconda, for example? that they can use in a means that that will actually enable more gameplay. Can we get a second fusion material that's uh, that only requires two monsters? But I don't know my boys. Y'all y'all got to let me know what y'all think about this cuz I definitely do not I'm I am so tired of this injustice. You know, it's just it's it's, it's ridiculous. Don't forget, my book is coming out April 15th going to have all the spiciest content to teach you how to play the game of Yu-Gi-Oh. Check it out, my boy, in the links below. There he is. 107. So good, bro. <laughs> ah! <laughs> I want to take the full ride. All So we might get a reaction out of this, this guy. And then we might get, yeah, it will definitely have game time. So we'll see, we'll see what happens. All right, so 19. What? No way, it's Winda? <laughs> Damn, I was not expecting Winda, bro. Thank God. I was hoping that he um, stopped summoning Windas. <laughs> this in the back row. 
24. back first let's take that wait okay you can only use it once per turn I was about to say hold on a second am I cooking let's say am I cooking with this <laughs> <laughs> Are we cooking? All right. So this is pretty good too because when you put when you end on this board, you end with two materials. Like this is actually pretty good. Okay, I, I get it now. If you end on a board like this, you end with two materials engraved with this card. So that means next turn you're gonna fuse. This is, okay, this is good. I, I get it. This is a good card. Cause you're gonna have fusion options cause you're using the materials at the end of that attack. And the quest to put it back in hand. So that's that's really good when you think about it. And then the, and then the return card is gonna be either a monster negate or a spell negate. This is disgusting actually. This is actually busted. This is actually busted. <laughs> when you realize the combo is busted. <laughs> we put the pressure on this ritual beast, dude. I ain't gonna lie though. We put the pressure on it. We put the pressure on it by clapping those windows and then also retaliating and popping that too. So basically we just put, we just put, and we put damage on him too. Like we just put a lot of pressure on him. He's got to go all in to, to hold us back. Like, what card are you going to put back, actually? Because the only way it really hurts me is if it goes back to the deck. Ooh, that's the wrong card to put back. You put the hand trap back? That's going to be...